Hello YouTube, welcome to another video by the Geo Scholar. This globe will not be the centerpiece of this video, something else will. This world map will be the centerpiece of the video, and there's a very important reason for that. Gaul Stereographic Projection. As is indicated on the map, this type of map is a Gaul Stereographic Projection. This type of projection, it's a cylindrical type. It has its roots back to 1855. It was developed by Scottish cartographer and clergyman James Gall. What makes this map a cylindrical projection? The meridians are mapped to be evenly spaced, and by meridians, these lines of, lo of longitude. These are lines of longitude. They are mapped to be evenly spaced. These circles of latitude are horizontal lines. And notice this is the Arctic Circle, but it's represented by a horizontal line, this line of latitude. One thing to understand about map projections, you're trying to take a surface like the Earth, round, shaped like a ball, and you're trying to represent this on, on a flat surface. You're trying to represent this on a flat surface and you get a lot of distortion as a result. You look at Greenland, you look at the polar regions, and you look, these areas look a lot larger on the map than they really are. There's a lot of distortions towards the poles. Now, if you get towards the 45 degree line, you tend to have a lot less distortion. You tend to have a lot less distortion around the 45 degree line, but you get further away from there, you have a lot more distortion. And the same goes when you go 45 degrees south. That's 45 south. Yeah, 45 south right there. And as you can see, Antarctica. The whole idea of the Gaul stereographic projection is there's an understanding that there's going to be distortion. The idea was how to balance that distortion. That was what was in mind when this was developed. This is a map of equally spaced meridians. This is a map of latitude circles being represented as horizontal lines. You have a lot of distortion, albeit there's an attempt and an effort to balance this distortion. And that is the Gaul stereographic projection, and in, a, in a nutshell at least. If you like this video, check out other videos on the Geo Scholar. If you would like to support the channel even more, the link to my Patreon is in the description box. And as always, be sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe.